Alright, welcome back. This is a review for Fruits Basket 2019, episode 21. Uh, sorry I've been late with uh, posting these. If you've been trying to watch them every week, I've been busy and then I started a teaching job and there was I had to do planning and end service and I've just been really... I mean, I've kept up with the episodes as they've been airing, but I just haven't had the time to be able to do uh, the reviews of them, unfortunately. <laughs> but now that uh, everything's kind of settling into place and I'm not quite as busy... Um, I uh, should be able to catch right back up with these in terms of the reviews. Um, so this episode probably is going to be a bit shorter just because I don't really have as much to talk about with it. It's because it's not too complicated of an episode. Um, but in this episode, obviously, it's about uh, the Yuki Fan Club going over to Hana's house in order to try and um, figure out what her weakness is so they can get to her so that they, they can ultimately get to Toru and remove Toru from being around Yuki. Um, and it's actually a really, I actually really enjoyed this episode. Um, because, I don't know, there's, the way that this episode is framed in terms of its comedic value is, a, I feel like, like it's a lot better than how the original did the comedy for this episode. Um, the, the original had, I don't know, it was just, to me, the original, the comedy for this episode was, especially during the beginning half, where it's just concentrating on the Yuki fan club girls. Um, I was kind of, it was, I wouldn't say it was completely cringy, but it was kind of pushing it towards almost cringy at times, at least to me, it, it was kind of how it felt. And then, and so I'd always be like, okay, just gotta sit through this first half of the episode and then get to the second half to actually get to the good part, which is, um actually getting to interact and being there with Hana and then meeting her little brother, uh, Meg uh, Megumi, or Megumi, uh, who, great kid, he's, he's so much fun. Um, but this, and that's how I always kind of felt with the 2001 version, but, uh, with this one, I actually, they, I actually really enjoyed even the first half where it was just concentrating on the Yuki fan club girls and that they, it was funny and it was but it, but it wasn't taken too over the top. It wasn't too wacky and crazy. And it, it like if you go and compare this episode to the 2001 version, you'll understand what I'm talking about in terms of the comedic, the comedy is just it's a bit different. I, I, for me, I always felt the 2001 version was a bit too over the top. It was a bit too oh let's make these Yuki fan club girls over dramatic and goofy and silly and just off the wall. But this one, it's, no, no, you see that they are at least somewhat grounded into reality. I mean, they're, they definitely need a wake-up call, and that is, that, as uh, Megumi says, you know, you can't, you know, just liking him doesn't give you a right to, to say whatever you want about the people who he hangs out with, or who, or about him himself, and, you know, stuff like that. Um, they definitely need a little wake-up call there, but... Um, they're a little, definitely a little bit more grounded in reality than at least the 2001 version, which had them, had them doing over the top goofy things. Um, but I like the comedic value, or not, that kind of says, that kind of sounds weird, but I like the comedy a lot better in this one, uh, the 2019 version than I do in the original. It's... Uh, it flows a lot better and it connects a lot better. There's a little bit of reference to, I think, the original, like with um, the kid walking down the street and then the girls just um, at near the very end after Megumi, you know, calls them all out by name. You know, the little boy walking down the street and then the, the girls all run out of the house. That's kind of a scene, again, and that's what actually 2019 likes to do a lot. It likes to pay homage to the original series and some of its shot compositions some of the scenes that it does. Um, but it, it's a good a good episode. I enjoyed it. There's, again, not really too much to talk about. Um, but it does, it actually re leads really well into the next episode, which I'll get to when in my next review, and I'll probably bring this episode up briefly. Um, but, I mean, that's really about it. It's not a very, and there's not really much, again, there's not really much to talk about with this episode. Um, that's about it, so thanks for watching, and bye for now.